Alright, what's up guys? Hasplank here with some Assassin's Creed. Ooh. And here's the thing. I'm playing this with a PS3 controller. I hooked up my PS3 controller to the computer. So now we're gonna be playing this with the PS3 controller. I'm still kind of configuring the controls a little bit. So here we go. Let's just jump right on in. So that seems pretty fluent. I my to no wisdom. How do I how do I look around? I that this also what the heck? Whoa! 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 These controls are confusing. Oh my gosh! Whoa! 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 That's confusing. We've got a problem. Okay, move this to walk. I can't anchor him to the memory. Too much psychological trauma. He's rejecting the treatment. Retreating. Okay, apparently, holding L2 makes it go that way, and holding R2 makes it go this way. Let me try and stabilize. Some is going on here. Whoa! Ah! Ah! Something's going on. Punch him! Punch! Punch! I don't know what's going on. At least I got the O triangle. You can hear the clicking. At least I got those configured right. I got the moving. I don't. I don't have the looking configured right. Whoa! 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 This is confusing me. High profile. How do I? No, I don't want to turn my camera. <laughs> ah! <laughs> ah! Ah! You okay? Ah! I told you he'd be fine. Bastards! No, at least I got a recording. I just saved your life. Saved my life? Shh, shh, they're talking. You kidnapped me. You strapped me into that thing. Animus. I mean, it's an this animus. Out of the way. I don't even know you people. Why are you doing this to me? Why are you guys doing this? You to have him? information we need, Mr. Miles. Information? Information. I'm a bartender for Christ's sake. Bartender, guys. What do you want me to do? Teach you how to mix a martini? We know who you are. They know who we are. Shh. I don't know what you're talking about. Don't play coy with me. There isn't time. You're an assassin. And He's an assassino. You it or not, you've got something that my employers want. Locked away in that head of yours. In but I'm head. not an assassin. Not anymore. Yes, your file indicated as much. Something about an escape. Most fortunate for us. What do you want from me? For you to do as you're told. The Animus will allow us to locate what we need. Once we have it, you'll be free to go. I am not going back in there. Then we'll induce a coma and continue our work. When we're done, you'll be left to die. Truth be told, the only reason you're still conscious is because this approach saves us time. True that. You're insane. So what is He's insane! <gasps> live or die? I choose live. Lie down. I'm lying down. A wise decision. Okay, so here's the confusing thing. Why, why is R2 moving this? Where am I? You're inside the animus. Okay, that I can select with this. It's a projector that renders genetic memories in three dimensions. Genetic memory. Seems okay. you'll need a bit of a tutorial. Very well. We'll start simple. What is a memory, Mr. Miles? His face is a little decent. Recollection of a past event. Specific to the individual remembering the event. Yeah, sure. <laughs> what if I told you that the human... Why does this do this? ...individual's memory, but the memories of his ancestors... And why are these controls not inverted? Genetic memory, if you will. Migration, hibernation, reproduction. <sighs> How do animals know when and where this is to so go? confusing. What to do? 
I'm going to have to play around with these controls. Now you're arguing semantics, Mr. Miles. Whatever you call it, the fact remains. These creatures hold knowledge absent the requisite first-hand experience. I've spent the past 30 years trying to understand why. I discovered something most fascinating. Our DNA functions as an archive. It contains not only genetic instructions passed down from previous generations, but memories as well. The memories of our ancestors. And the Animus lets you decode and read these DNA files. Precisely. But there's a problem. This is the specific memory we're trying to access. That one? Unfortunately, when we try and open the memory, your mind withdraws. You lack the confidence to step into your ancestor's body. I That's see. what happened earlier. You got knocked out of the target memory and pushed back to a more stable state. Which I'm guessing is this one. Ah, your face is desynced from the audio. Ah, oh, don't watch. We found similar reactions among patients who undergo hypnosis to relive traumatic events. They can't Watch. jump directly into the specific memory. They need to be eased in. Even then, there can be problems. <sighs> Look away. Desynced. So how do we fix it? We start over here. We find a memory you can synchronize with. And we move forward from there. You'll get used to it. This is the closest we can get. So it's where we'll have to see it. Because I played this game already. Okay. No! <laughs> Don't you dare call me again. Okay, why does the right analog stick not do anything? Warning. Data stream unstable. Attempting to restore synchronization. Hello, Subject 17. This tutorial has... I don't care what it is. Okay, guys, I'm gonna try and figure these controls. I will uh, be right back. Okay, guys, I am... Uh, I think I figured it out. If you ever fall completely out of sync, the animus will restore you to your last synchronized position. You are currently dangerously close there we to go. synchronization. Please follow all four. Oopsie, sorry guys. Um, camera. Book sensitivity up one more. Okay. Should we get instructions in order to restore The animus utilizes a puppeteering concept to control the actions of your ancestor. Unloading subroutines to validate your body's adaptation to the animus. We will begin by exploring the default actions of each input. Okay. <laughs> Set up the control. Still. Use the head button to observe your environment. Okay. I see. Look at them. Look at them! Good. Good. Ooh. Empty hand to walk through these dark corners without causing What the frock? the marker to continue the synchronization process. What the frock is going on? I'm so confused. Holy shiz. Move, ladies! Don't make me knock over your pots. I will do it. I'm not afraid to do it. Gosh. You monsters. I did it. Yay. PS3 controller. You can hear it. Low profile and high profile. R1. Ah, uh, that's... actions are socially acceptable. High profile Touches this. Are more I'm not. Oriented. See the HUD change. To see how your heads up display changes the context of the puppet. I see, I see. Grab you! You're mine. Excellent. You're mine, Dust. Infinite plane of space, you're mine. We will continue your synchronization process by testing some high profile actions. Alright. Can I tackle him? Throw this individual onto the marker. By using the empty hand button in high profile. Okay, I can do this. <sighs> Come here! Good. Goodbye! <laughs> Woo! This is fun. Using your legs button in high profile will allow you to sprint. Sprinting is useful to escape from soldiers or to get closer to a fleeing target. However, okay. be careful not to bump. Reach the mark before the man does, I remember this. 
Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on, come on, come on, come on. While sprinting, I don't care. Before this man does. Okay. <laughs> yes. Suck it. <laughs> Woo! The Can I assassinate him? Provide other important information. Can I assassinate him? The social status icon gives you information on your social status. The different states will be explained. Take a second to so look awesome. Time to go. This icon this icon appears when a soldier is looking at you. Okay, yellow the yellow color means the soldier is either unaware or suspicious of who you are. I see. To illustrate the change in awareness level, you will stealth assassinate this soldier. Oh, hell yes. First, walk onto your target. Now, select Take a second to... Oh, okay, it's up. Alright, good. With your blade selected, walk up to the soldier and assassinate him by using your armed hand button. Which is this one. Yes! Oh god, there's a guy right there. Where's the one responsible for this? I don't know. Where am I? Shh, don't tell him. Don't tell him it was me. The dead body has alerted the soldier and changed his awareness to informed, as represented by the red witness indicator. Actions I can't even jump! This is terrible. Undertaken at this time will likely provoke an armed response. Provoke this soldier. Okay. You know what? Jump! Notice how the social status I see. Changed to expose. Break the line of sight by climbing the ladder. Alright, let's roll. Alright, let's do this. You jerk! Climb, 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 climb. Yes, I can. Climb, 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 climb. climb. Into the thingy. Excellent. The line of sight has been broken. Now hide in the roof garden. Roof garden to hide from the soldier. All right, let's do this. Woo! Shh, shh, I'm vanishing. Your social status indicates that you are hidden, but the soldier is still looking for you. Even though I'm right there. Oh, he's coming! Shh. Changes again. Shh, he's coming. You do well. Yeah, that's right. I'm glad I hid, so I don't have to deal with morons like you. The soldier has lost your track. Woo! Now anonymous, and you can exit the hide spot. Cool. Excellent. This feels so cool playing it with my PS3 controller. Being anonymous will fill your synchronization bar and make your job as an assassin easier. Cool. There are different places which you can use to hide. Uh... However. You must always break the line of sight first, and then use a hide spot to vanish. Haystacks. Is this the tutorial boring part? Scholars. Look like me. Alright. Yeah, you guys paying attention? Good. Alright. Let us continue. Where's my sword? Demonstration of blend. Blend can be activated with the power oh, of your leg. Oh, they're aware. Okay, shh. You can mimic a scholar and pass near soldiers without arousing suspicion. Mimic a scholar. The marker behind the soldier. Yeah, it's not like I'm carrying swords and a bunch of different weapons. No, I'm just a little scholar. Don't mind me. Shh. Don't mind me! I'm going to go study. Shush. Shush your face. Shush. Don't mind my giant sword. Do you see it? It's standard for all, all scholars to carry. In case someone tries to be a bully and knock our books out of our hand, we can just we can just stab them. Thank you. That is all. Good. See you later, suckers. <sighs> Woo! Alright. You are fully sane. A new ability is available to you. Cool. Referred to as ego vision, this sixth sense helped your ancestor understand the intentions of people around him. Just let me ego vision. Well done. So white's normal person, yellow's target, red's enemy, and blue is friendly, I believe. Remember, eagle vision will only be available once you are fully synced. Okay. Please note that following the Assassin's Creed, your ancestor's way of life will assist you with staying in sync. Cool. The creed consists of three tenets. First, 
Never hurt an innocent person. Second, always be discreet. Third, hide in plain sight. No, shush. It's don't compromise the brotherhood. I think. Hide in plain sight too. Don't forget to hide in plain sight. Don't forget this. Don't forget this. Need to remember. Hide in plain sight. He looks a lot like Desmond. I think they use the same face model for Atayir and Desmond. Look at that. It's beautiful. It's beautiful! Whee! Wait! There must be another way! There must be another way! He doesn't need to. Don't kill him! Oh, you monster! That old man did not need to die. Fortune favors your blade. Not fortune, skill. Watch a while longer and you might learn. Glitches. Press any button. Really? I'm pressing these buttons. Huh? Why can I not move? Oh, because I'm not allowed to move. See? F you. Goodbye. Knocked him out. KO'd him. Yes, nothing is transmitted. It matters not how we complete our task. Only that it's done. But this is not the way of my way is better. Yeah. I'll tell you. A rogue badass. He'll do that. He'll do that to you. Can I step over this guy's body, please? What is our mission? My brother would say nothing to me. Only that I should be honored to have been invited. The master You're gonna die. The found something beneath the temple I think. Spoiler alert, I think he dies. I do not know. All that matters is the master considers it important. Else he would not have asked me to return. Can I step over this dead man, please? Okay, thank you. Alright. Parkours, hardcores, parkours. Wow. My ladder. Oh, I saw a glitch in that camera. Did did didn't did didn't did didn't did That must be the arc. What? I'm just gonna look at this wall. Look at this wall. No just gonna come look at this wall. I'm looking at the wall. I'm not looking. Fine, I'll go look. I see. Robert de Saab. His life is mine. No. Life you would ask to retrieve the treasure and deal with Robert only if necessary. He stands between us and it. I'd say it's necessary. It is necessary. Let's do this, Leroy Jenkins. You mean cowardice? That man is our greatest enemy. Come on, I can take him. Chance to be rid of him. Just let me take control of Altair. You have already broken two tenets of our creed. Now you would break the third. Yes. Do not compromise the brother. I will break it. I am your superior in both title and exactly. Appearance. Deal with it. Better than to question me. Yeah, shut up. You are mine. Ow. You're still mine. You are not the only ones with business here. Ah. Well, this explains my missing man. And what is it you want? To kill you. This guy, is, I'm gonna kill him. I'm going to kill this guy. I spare you only that you may return to your master and deliver a message. The Holy Land is lost to him and his. He should flee now while he has the chance. Never! And all of you will die. I'm going to stab you! Oh, here no! Well, she is. No. no. Sniffle, sniffle. I'll miss those guys. Now let's get out of here. I know we have to do some hardcore parkour. It's okay. We're all tired. We can hardcore parkour all we want. Up, up, up! Come on, get along now, puppy. Up, up. Alright. Row 
rolling, rolling, rolling on me. I see freedom. Skipping part of memory to a more reasonable one. Alright guys, we're gonna go ahead and end this episode off here. Like, favorite, subscribe. Have fun.